I think. I think I'm ready to go live. Pretty sure I'm ready to go live. And I hope you are too. Hello, subscribers and future subscribers. I'm Karma Jolt. This game, I am very proud to announce, is Fragrant Story for the Nintendo DS system. No, I'm Rogue, says Rogue Effect. Thank you for being here in the chat. I appreciate you. This game is called Fragrant Story. It was made by Squire Games and my man, my man William Cage, who I, I always want to pronounce it Kage like he's from Naruto. But this guy reached out to me on the internet and was like, hey, I like you. I appreciate your style and the way you narrate games and stream. So I'm going to send you a t-shirt and also a copy of my game, which I believe is being released this month. Um, this is Fragrant Story. From what I know about it, it's a tactics RPG that's very cute, and the music is awesome because this guy not only programs the games, but he also makes the music. You may recognize the name if you've been with the Karma Jolt channel for a while because a long time ago I streamed his demo for a game called Otasan, which was a very earthbound -y game with a great sense of humor and it was fun to play. What's going on, Sean R? And you're smelling handsome. Yes, thank you. Matt H. Isn't this game like two missions long and was a huge scam? No? <laughs> uh, no, I don't know why you think that. Oh, it's made by Squire Enox. Yes, exactly. Uh, but I am playing Fragrant Story on an actual 3DS, and we're gonna go through it together. Hello, it's a me, Elliot. What up, guys? Yo, Elliot S., I appreciate you. Matt H., where'd you hear that information? I have no idea what you're talking about. Here it is, new who. What's going on, Zan? So, this is already very cute, and I appreciate the sound effects. There's a ticket shop. Spend tickets and stanks here. Well, let's take a look. I can buy recovery items, challenge keys, or mango tickets, which I obviously want to save up for. I saw a video on it. I, I don't know what to say. It's like... The dude basically gives everything away for free, and like all, from what I understand, 100% of the profits of this game go to charity. Um, and if you join his Patreon, he sends you a T-shirt. What's up, Any Enigma? I see you. And Carlos Phillips. Sup, Karma Jolt. Hope the weather good where you are at, bro. It's not. It's been snowing like crazy, which has been fun. But yo, let's jump right into this game after I look at the donors, obviously. Which, like, I don't think I'm up here. I subscribe to his Patreon patron, full disclosure. But, like, the guy approached me a while back with a deal. He's like, look, I like you a lot. I want to have your name on my Patreon. So if you subscribe to my $1 Patreon, Patreon patron, as a $1 Patreon patron, I will give you $3 per month on your Patreon. And I'm like, that math adds up for me. So yeah, these are all the people. These are all the people. What's up, Radden? Let's hop into this game. Let's go to story mode. Let us fight. Darkness dwells nearby. Legendary treasure, zero out of three found. Hard mode only? Well, I want to find the legendary treasures. Uh, this is cool that there are difficulty settings. The stench level is low. Justin Bailey, I see you with the cool five dollars. Hey, this guy hates charity. <laughs> Appreciate you. Thank you so much. I'm gonna go with stench level putrid. Begin with three tokens. Timed hits are unreliable. Ooh, I love that there's a timed hits mechanic. Spinner auto or hidden? Obviously, I want to see the cutscenes. Let's press start. So, you've decided to lend your skills to the ancient aroma. It's voice. A wise decision. After all, it is the noblest of pursuits. What's up, Chaos V? I see you. But first, you must take an oath. You must make a solemn promise. It's not a scam. It's people on the internet complaining they think it should cost less. All the plants you once took for granted. I see you, Sean. 
we must even bow our heads to the humble weeds and laurels. Only then will we truly begin to blossom. Now, what I read on his website... It's time to ready those redolent roots of yours. And this explains the scan lines on the graphics. What you're capable of. Is that this game is an arcade game within the universe of Otosan. And the characters that you can play in this game come from Otosan. Yeah, look at this. I recognize Chessie. Her special is chess check. Ooh, and there are characters to unlock, too. All right, so this guy is required. Let's put Rhubarb um, somewhere in the... Oh, what is this? Oh, okay, so I insert a coin to add a character on the field, and I can insert another coin to give him an extra level? I think I want more characters. Obviously, I'm gonna go with Chessie because I remember this character. But how do I, um... How do I change the position of, like, where... I put the character on the map? Oh, okay, so I hold the Y button. Oh, wait, never mind. I don't think I get to pick where the character spawns. So Chessie is always gonna be in front of Rhubarb. And let's put in Ash... Who I think was the main character in Otosan, is that correct? What's up, Any Enigma, high school friend? No, this game had to release only first campaign at launch. With the rest being a patch later. That's why people thought it was a scam. Oh, interesting. Okay, I see you, Jamalad. lad. I, I didn't know that there was, like, that much, um awareness of it first of all secondly like on the website it's like yeah the patch it's zero dollars but the dude delivered hey yeah i appreciate the information definitely feel like i've heard this game before but i don't know what it is says rad and well we're about to find out let's put an ash he's got a wooden bat you know what though like do i want a ranged character Range Revelry from this Perfumador. The name is Bree. I love that. Specialist snack time. Um, and it shows their movement, too, and their critical hit rate. I love that. Let's put in a Grain Gunner. This is Papaya. Attack is Seed Sling. Ballistics buff. All right, let's do it. And then let's press start to begin. Will there be a scratch and sniff physical copy? Queen Mango. Yo, Anthony B. Step forward. I got it right here, as a matter of fact. Thanks to William Cage, my man. Ah, I just smacked my microphone. I love her voice. And let your bravery blossom. Um, who does she sound like? Does she sound like Bjork? What what is that accent? I can't quite place it. Is that like Icelandic? Another lovely morning. Or it would be if it weren't for those fiends approaching. What? What's the matter? Fiends is one letter away from Thought friends. You see any trouble on your first day? Come on. Time to show these ne'er do wells that flowers can fight back. Flowers can fight back. Clicked on the stream to see the plants are pleased. Yo, Daisy O, so am I. I'm glad you're here. This battle has a royal chest. Only a florista can open it, and only with a critical hit. Okay. That sounds cool. There. Okay, so I, they just flings me into this battle. And the treasure chest is over here. I imagine I have to be next to it to critical hit it. So let's start going. They flip into place? He doesn't walk. Yo, look at this dude. That man can easily dunk. This is like some Space Jam-ish right here. Look at this movement. I have melee attacks. Oh wait, Drain Vine, what does that do? Range attack that steals life. I'm gonna stand by for now. Um, and have Chessie 
walk up, not walk up, I'm gonna have her jump, jump right up to this fly. Move enemy in lock position. Melee attack can be critical. Let's attack this Bramble Bee. Oh, it just like always hits? Okay. Okay, so I scored a hit. If I attack this guy from here, that will like end the battle, will it not? I want to get that treasure chest. Ah. It doesn't show me the damage values, which I find... unusual. He's down to one heart out of two is what it looks like. Don't forget to watch the sunset with the like button. Rogue Effect, have you been watching Mr. Ballin? Yo, Jordy Pants, I see you. All right, I'm gonna run away from this Bramble Bee. Is that what it's called? Maybe have Chessie block here. Cause I wanna get. Ooh, it missed me. Play your turn. Ooh, and there are settings? Okay, and I can get an overview. Let's have Rhubarb run toward this chest and stand by. Um, can I see this guy's movement range? No, I can't. Or at least I don't know how. Let's have this guy stand by. What system is this game on? Yo, Justin McDonald? It is on the Nintendo 3DS. They missed Chessie twice. Your wheel is off is the best part of this game. My wheel is off? Um, is that something I can change in the settings? Yo, Tim C, what's going on? Uh, thank you for that weird fact and the three dollars. I'm gonna end turn here. He's gonna kill my guy here. Yo, he straight up died. Maybe I shouldn't play on hard mode. But, like, I need to get to this chest. And also, there's, like, two enemies here. It'll be fine. It'll be fine. Everything's fine. When you start it, it lets you select difficulty in turning the spinner on or off. Yeah, I saw that. I, I don't think I turned it off. Jimmy lad? Let's start all over then. Because if I'm missing the best part of the game, I want to know. Plus, like, one of my guys died. You unlocked Quick Start from the menu. Yo, look at that Squire Games logo. Okay, yeah, I was I I was wondering what the spinner was. I didn't mean to turn that off. So let's start over. I messed up, everybody. All right, let's go to let us fight. So I want manual, right? still think you know what let's start with normal am I being too cocky with starting on hard mode yes <laughs> okay thank you you are forgiven says chaos V Okay, yeah, so the timed hits is related to the spinner. Is that what I'm seeing, Jimmy lad? 
Time hits do not trigger instantly. Let's try normal mode. Because I'm a scrub, usually. So, And I think I'll skip through this dialogue this time. And we're going to go with the same characters, I think. But there's, there's not going to be any legendary treasure, is that correct? Oh my gosh, I still have two more tokens? All right, let's put in Ash and Bree. Let's go. Defenders of Flower. I like that you can mash through that too. Hey, yo, Elliot S. Nothing like that in my chat, ah, please. Yes. Another lovely morning. Or it would be, if it weren't for those feet. Thank you. Time to show these ne'er do wells that flowers can fight back. Okay, Jimalad, thank you so much. Alright, here we go. Let's. So, yeah, there's no legendary treasure. Which I'm, like, curious about, but oh my gosh, the way they jump in this game. I can jump over enemies, too. I'm gonna have him wooden bat the far Brambleby here. Oh, okay. And it looks like... Yeah, it looks like the critical hit... Ash gained a level. It looks like the critical hit uh, icon on the spinning wheel... Vile, vile. Ranged attack can be critical. Is that critical? Oh no, that's a miss. I thought I was aiming for that. Okay. So yeah, it looks like the critical hit is right next to like a miss icon. Easy money. Oh no, more enemies. They are bugs. Well, these two, like, already gained level ups. I'm gonna have them stand by. Papaya needs to level for sure. You know what? I'm gonna have them come to me. They really didn't. Get them, Bree. All right, let's get my ranged units in the fight here. I'm going to assume they can defeat these bugs in one hit. <laughs> the movement is so quick. All right, Bree. Hit him with the vile vile. So what's the blue icon? Is that the critical hit? Bam. Bree gained a level. For... For swatting a fly, I feel like in this universe, it's very easy to get stronger. <laughs> Gosh, the jumping is so good. Just a regular all hit here. Yo, Carlos Phillips. Amazing. What's my new friend Molly M up to tonight, Karma? Jordy Pants? I don't know. She's like out somewhere. Which is weird, because we're having like a blizzard. All right, let's get Chessie into the action here. And everyone else close by. Man, oh my gosh, I love that they jump and flip. Blue is also a hit, but weather is nice. Oh, blue shield is block, I see, okay. All right, Chessie, go smack this dude. I'm, I'm just using, like, regular melee attacks here. Let's try to get a crit. Oh, I just barely got it, too. Chessie gained a level. Ooh, 
a blizzard. I heard it's supposed to get by me like Tuesday. Uh, yeah, stay safe out there, everybody. You earned standard ranks, aka stanks. I love that. Enemies vanquished, 2,750. No, I think it was fewer than that, but... What do I know? I didn't even have the spinners on at first. Then my friend Gemilad was like, um, you're playing the game wrong. Something dark is brewing. I can feel it. Such I love that voice. Profound darkness. The source is not far from Surely there's a better method of locomotion than back flipping. I yes, front flipping. The block and crit are consumables, which is weird and different. You have Bree can refill them, though. That's amazing. Okay, thank you for all the information. Gemilad, how do you know all this? Did you get yourself a copy of the game? Oh, okay, I go straight into the second battle. I don't get to choose a new party or anything. Uh, interesting. So, it seems like after... I die, or after I'm done with the battles, I go back to the main menu and I can spend, like, certain resources to get permanent upgrades, kind of like a roguelike? Is that what I'm understanding here? Can't drain vine. Is everyone level 2? Yeah, they are. What is this thing? Sewer trap? Hardly newer trap. Don't take that out of context. Mile High Gamer, what's going on? Is it just me, or is something about the Queen's voice giving Bjork? That's what I was saying! What's up, Greta Evans? There's a Stanks coin in the previous collector's box set. It's hilarious, NGL. I'm glad you mentioned that. I'll go get that in a second, because my man William Kage, aka William Cage. I keep calling him Kage. But yeah, William Cage, he sent me a whole bunch of stuff, including that coin that you're talking about, which I should have grabbed. Uh, let's, let's have Bree move over here. I think I can hit this guy from here, yeah. Easy money. Yo, I crit the sewer trap. And I'm gonna have Ash stand here and block so that no one can hit Bree, who has 2 HP. I, well, I guess everyone has 2 HP here, huh? I know it well because early adopter, so it was there for the short version of the game. Smelly Bat is trying to attack me. Do I not want the green ones? Like, I don't think I do. Those look like critical hits. Or maybe he also drains life, is what I'm looking at there. I'm gonna rose sword this Smelly Bat. Hello, Smelly Bat. I'm just gonna do a regular hit here. Bat. For one damage. Get him, Ash. Dead. Take that, wildlife. Oh, okay, so Ash got one HP back. Oh, yeah, okay, and I see it now. Like, next to the uh, to my character's information, it shows two hearts for health, two critical hits left available this battle. This game stinks, says Tumblio. I hope I pronounce your name right. But yes, it does, and welcome. But yeah, this is cool. This guy is not moving? Can he not move out of the water? Get him, papaya. Can't quite hit from there. I will wait for, Lur for the next turn. 
What is snack time? Oh, that's awesome. Okay. Ah, okay. So her special is that I can refill a heart, potentially, or a critical hit thingy, or a block. Uh, that was bad. I was trying to refill a heart. But it's okay. We all make mistakes. Except for some of you, apparently. You guys are very cool and don't make mistakes. That's crazy. I can hit this guy from here, right? Reckless attack! Uses one critical hit. And it just, like, hits everyone within range? Okay, so it can hit up to three targets, I think is how that works. Well, let's hit him with a sword. Hey, Karma Luigi. Yo, the SOB2? This is a game by William Cage, and I'm wearing a t-shirt with his name on it. More sewer traps! Um... I think the stars under their name indicate their experience. Does that sound right? She's gonna level up, I think. Crunch! Yeah, gained a level block plus one? Oh, I think I heard about this. Oh, uh, that's awesome. I've heard about it too. Yo, Taisho On, what's going on? I missed your Tetris attack stream. I was gonna see if you wanted to do battle in that game, maybe next time. Um, I would possibly play a two player game, yeah. But yeah, I, I ended up playing Tetris Attack last night as well as like a bunch of other games on the Switch. Like uh, I played some Wario's Woods for a while, some Dr. Mario. And then I ended up playing Nightshade for a little bit on the NES. And that game is funny as hell. Bah! I crit the sewer trap. All right, now here's the thing. Oh, oh, there's like a little mouse dude in the on the left. I was like, are there any enemies? <laughs> he can't come across the water. Oh, does this like cost something to use? I guess not. Let's try it again. Yes, refill the heart. All right, yes, yeah, stars is XP, but yeah, same diff because they get one XP per monster. Don't forget Kermit, <laughs> yeah. I, for, for whatever reason, I attempted to do a Kermit the Frog voice. Yesterday. Drain bomb. Okay, so that looks like hit and steal a heart. Okay. The, the slappy sound effects are amazing. Uh, Ash is level three. Let's let's see if I can level someone else up here. Chessie's level three as well. Let's hit him with the vile vile. It's clever. This game's clever. Do you download the DLC before store close? Edex Wolf? Oh no, more enemies. Um. No, I have not downloaded the DLC. He literally just like sent me a physical copy and some equipment with which to stream and was like, load it up. I think, so I think this does have the DLC on it though. Karma Jolt is basically a pro voice actor. I wish. But yeah, Tumblejoe, how do I pronounce your name? 
Still loving your snake voice. Appreciate you, Zan. That was a very nice thing. Yeah, I, the man has been insanely generous to me. But I'm not gonna let that influence my opinion about this great game that you should purchase today. Pre-order now! I, <laughs> he's not like sponsoring me or anything, but like he sent me a shirt. He is a Patreon patron. Um, and like just for Christmas he sent me a copy of the game as well as some other stuff. All gift wrapped and like a nice little note that was like heartfelt, so that was super cool of William Kage Cage. What the hell is going on? <laughs> Snake voice is same as Silent Hill voice. Kinda, yeah, exactly, Sean R. Okay, so these things look like Reeky Wolves. They have four movement. So they can stand. Actually, they can hit Papaya, or this guy can. One, two, three, four. Yeah, yeah, you can stand. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna have Papaya move one away and get out of their range, I think. I'm gonna have them come to me. As well as Bree. I'm gonna have Bree jump away. Rhubarb is only level two? Okay, Rhubarb and Papaya need to get a kill. Oh my gosh, wait a second. And you can you can upgrade your abilities I'm seeing now at the bottom of the screen. Defeat an enemy with normal attack to upgrade ability? Recover a crit with snack time. Defeat an enemy with scatter shot. Okay. I'm gonna end my turn here. Yeah, the movement animations. I love them so much. Ha <laughs> ha, the flipping. What's up, fighter? Would you play Octopath Traveler? Justin McDonald, I, I try, I really gave Octopath Traveler a shot and wasn't a huge fan of it. Um, I might try it again someday, but I could not get over the voices. And also like, I, I have an eye condition, which straight up prevents me from playing a lot of games. And when I was playing Octopath Traveler on PC, it was like, they had the whole screen, but the text box was like this, you know? And that, I realize is, is kind of a, a picky criticism. But it sort of prevented me from playing the game. Octopath is a really fun game, but the text is super small. Thank you, Greta Evans. I appreciate your confirming my my claims. Bah! Ba I love that sound effect. I hit him for two? Um, and then Papaya. Can't scatter shot. Oh, it uses a critical hit. Or it uses a critical hit icon, I guess. So, what's the difference between block and miss? The enemy has a limited number of blocks? Is that what I'm seeing? If I had rolled a block on that thing, it would have later replaced the wheel with uh, the block on the wheel with a hit icon, I guess? It's an accessibility thing, yes. Thank you, thank you. That's the word I'm looking for. You said my name right because you are a professional. Tumble Joe? I said it two different ways, but I think the second time is what you mean, right? Square games are really egregious about text size. I don't think that's petty at all. You have to be able to read it to enjoy it. Thank you. I, this, okay, so I have an eye condition called keratoconus. It begins with a K and ends with an onus. Um, essentially, my eyes are shaped irregularly. Unlike astigmatism where it's like, oh, your eyes, like your corneas are more ovular instead of spherical. Uh, or elliptical, I guess might be the word. My eyes are like irregular. Like I, I have like bumps and peaks and pits in them, you know? 
Um... So, I have to have these... Special contact lenses. And it's, what I'm getting at is it, it's a it's a condition that essentially dominates my life, you know? Um, wait, did Papaya move already? But that said, I am an enjoyer of games, or at least I want to be. And some games are hard to enjoy because they require you to have, like, normal people eyesight. Oh, so I get to spin the wheel. Watch this. Oh, wait, that was bad. <laughs> Does that character come back, I wonder? Watch this, I said. Wait, how much HP does this thing have? Three? F is correct. Let's scatter shot. I don't need a crit here. Uh, well, I got one. I didn't see... Oh, okay. I didn't see that there were two of them. Papaya gained a level. That, that sound effect when I killed the enemy sounded familiar. You look at that. I got 69, 420 stanks. Normal people eyesight is overrated. I wouldn't know, Jordy Pants. You unlocked the challenge menu. New battle added to quick start menu. That's cool. All right. I love that I'm unlocking things. Also, I love that you're here. Chapter three, Bramble Hollow. Hmm. I wonder why they call it that. It's like the rumors were true. Perhaps we there are brambles and it's hollow. Well, now that we've found the source of this stench, it's time to snuff it out. More like sniff it out. Yo, pit of something. Hey, this cool looking guy on YouTube Shorts told me to tell my friends he's great. He's pretty great You've with his cool been sunglasses. Born in my side. Wolf's you Bane. thought you defeated us, but we rose again. Clever. That's clever. Oh, my, what a reticent reek. Enough talk. He has a shirt. Let us fight. I did not expect that wolf to have a shirt. Let us fight. Ah, okay, so so death is permanent. Yikes. I shouldn't have been so reckless then. Or maybe I should have been more wreckful. Dog, come at me. Oh. Those wolves can jump very far. Ha ha ha. Yo, wolf's bane? Can I hit this guy from here? With a vile vile, I can. A smelly bat. Dev did the voice of Wolf's Pain. That's William Cage? That's dope. Alright, let's one tap this guy. Ugh, looks like I have to two tap him. That's okay. Um. Knockback enemy may collide. Oh, I see. Okay, let's let's try to get that to work at some point. So I can hit an enemy into an enemy, I think is how that attack works. Or at least that's what I remember from Otosan. That was close. Alright, so I took a hit there. 
Oh boy, Wolfsbane coming up fast. Drain Dive. I don't want him to recover a heart. So, so I actually control whether the enemy is hit or crit, essentially. Drain vine here. To get that one HP back. And kill the smelly bat. That sound effect, what is that from? When I kill the enemy. That sounds so familiar. Oh man, if I were here, I think I could hit this enemy into Wolfsbane. Let's wooden bat him. Bah! Worth. Um, and I might want to recover an HP for Ash, so let's try it. Uh, actually, first let's do this. Does Scattershot reach Wolfsbane? Oh my gosh, it does. too far. Okay, so, like, I don't know if it's, um... If when I hit the A button on the roulette wheel, it... It, like, it continues to spin for, like, one or two more panels. I don't know if it's always the same amount. Let's try to get a miss here. Woo! Okay, I got a block. Good enough. Whirlwind. Okay, so this looks like basically crit or miss. I blocked. That's fine. Okay, so yeah, I use... I have limited numbers of blocks per battle. That's an interesting mechanic. I kind of like that. This guy's only got one HP. I think I can drain vine him. Not that I needed the HP from that, but I couldn't melee attack him from where I was standing. Okay, Rhubarb gained a level. That's cool. I mean, I can pretty much take this guy out now. Push swing is OP. Oh, it automatically does one damage. I, I kind of expected it to damage my teammate there. I don't know why I did that. Just gotta not miss. Take that, Wolf's Bane! More like Wolves of Bean, because I hit him with a Seed Sling. It was a success, but why does the music sound like a failure? In normal, it is like a quarter turn delay and only a little random. Thank you, Gemalad. Appreciate you showing up, by the way. New battle added to Quick Start Menu. My gosh. Also, thank you so much to William thank the Hammer so Cage. Please step forward. You have vanquished the darkness. Thanks, Light Buster. Has been restored. 
but we must stay vigilant. Vigilant. No doubt. No the doubt. I love her voice. Oh my gosh. You unlocked a new character. It's this guy. New items added to ticket shop. You found a mango ticket? Use this to buy the mango tracker from the ticket shop. Time to track some mangoes, everybody. Okay, this is cool. Buy mango tickets. Equipment upgrades. Okay, I have one ticket. Okay, so in the bottom right, you see that I have stanks. I have like 18,010 of them. And one ticket. Which I can use... The tickets I can use to permanently increase... Uh, or I guess permanently buff my characters. I can get a thick K Kogi. Mango, yes, like the Smash Bros. player. Glass Queen, I love that. Glass Bishop? Ooh, I can get disco shoes. This is really cool. Simple key? Let's unlock a new challenge. You got access to a new challenge! It's Fran from FF12. You know what? I never played any of those. But yeah, I can buy a mango ticket. Now I have two of them. I can't get an upgrade with that. Never mind. I can get a mango tracker and an XP egg. <gasps> Practice slash normal only double XP. That seems like the best thing. Double stanks mission reward? I should probably get that as soon as I can. Wait, new colors? This is just like Earthbound. Oh my gosh. There's the plain background, the mint, the strawberry, banana, and peanut. In Earthbound, when you start the game, it asks you to choose your uh, flavor. And depending on what you pick, it changes like the border of the text boxes to a certain color. Like mint is like a mint green. Obviously. Sakimoto's loot. Yo, Sakimoto, the guy who made the soundtrack to Final Fantasy Tactics. There's some cool stuff about this game. Buy recovery items. I can get a life apple. Wait, Power Burger? I want Burgor. Dino gummies. <laughs> My gosh. And I can get a frog coin. Like from Super Mario RPG. This is fun. This is pretty neat. Alright, let's do a challenge. What's the mango tracker? It's only one ticket. Uh, you know what? Let's buy it. Greta Evans. I'm glad you said that. It looks like it... Yeah, it shows my completion progress. Oh, neat. 1%! And I can even turn it off if I want to hide my percentage completion from you. So that you don't know how far I am in this game. Or anyone, I guess. Okay, win tickets from special fights. Let's do a simple task. Begin with one token. Let's try it on hard mode. If I hit the A button, it reminds me, like, hey, press start to begin, idiot. Only 68 to go. You're right, rogue effect. All right, so who did I unlock? Albert, the devourer. Gorgeous gluttony. Jory with a B wand and can summon B. That seems like the best. Wait, this is a one player mission? That sounds like Zelda. I can't take my coin back? 
All right, let's do a challenge with this guy. He can move one. Oh, he recovers HP every turn is what it looks like. We have a lot of work to do here. I don't, you know what? If I had realized it was a one-person mission, I would have sent my scattershot guy. Who's that, Papaya? Uh, you know what? Bring it, rats. Miss! I'm gonna eat this rat now. Instantly defeat one opponent? Oh. That was scary! Oh my gosh, that sound effect? Albert gained a level. More like Devour Bert gained a level. Dang, I got hit. Well, let's devour again, dang. Ate him. I mean, this character that I unlocked seems pretty good. Ooh, whoa! Okay, I just died. Never mind. That time, the spinny wheel took a long time to stop after I hit the A button. Okay, let's try again. Okay, this game is legitimately hard. Oh wait, no, I thought it would bring me back to the menu. F is correct, Rogue Effect. Margella Cola, I see you. Oh, it brings me back to the main menu. Press start to play. Mango counter? What is my progress? 1%? Oh, God, that's not so bad. Let's do a simple task. And I'm going to play it on normal this time. That? Okay, so Albert doesn't look anything like he looks in the overworld. I have three perfumadors. Disco Mist? Okay. Um, I'm using Jory, the bee wizard. The bee mage, excuse me. I guess let's try some characters I ain't tried yet. Like Sasha. Why does she start all the way in the corner like that? The immediate restart is a good design choice. You think so? I think I might prefer if it went back to the previous menu. Eagles suck. I need some enjoyment in my life. Yo, Joe D, I don't think my Saints are making the playoffs, though. Let me, um... I just wanna check, I just wanna check sports. To see if we're out of the playoffs. Cause I think the Saints needed to win today, which they did, but they also needed the Bears to win, which is unlikely, and then the Cardinals to win, which is also unlikely. Yeah, they both lost. So I think that officially eliminates the Saints from playoff contention. Okay, so what can Jory do? B1 is a melee attack. Summon B? Call B ally, max one at a time. 
All right, I summoned a bee. Um, Sasha has Vile Vile, right? Yeah. So I'll move one. And attack this musky rat. I get it. It's like a musk rat. But it's musky. Vile Vile cannot critical hit. Saints didn't make it. I see you, Jody. Oh, I probably didn't want to summon my helper bee there then, huh? Whew! What a roll. Jory is one of my favorite characters. That bee is awesome, says Greta Evans. Heck yeah. Um, I can't get... Wait, Jory has one HP? I probably want to back off then. So what can Sasha do? Obstruct one tile? That doesn't seem that great. Take that, musky rat. Some of the sounds... Oh, you know what? Some of the sounds might be like altered sound effects from The Secret of Mana. Um, how do I command my B? Can I not? Oh, I can summon a note. Oh, never mind, I can't. One B at a time. It literally says max one B at a time. Dang it, my bees. Infinite bees! Would have been cool. I need to I need to block this. Whew! Press one, everybody. Or uh, press like a smoke cloud icon in the chat. Dang it. a tile. No, I want to fight this guy. I just want to hit him. Easy money. Yeah, but keep summoning more bees. End him, bees, turn. This is a great joke, Karma Jolt. B wand. Bah! And I leveled up. Let's go. Jory gained a B. Ooh, that was the challenge, everybody. You earned stanks. 3,450. You found a mango ticket. This is fun. This is pretty dope. It's like a weird combination of a tactics RPG and a roguelike. And a rogue effect. And I have 6,960. If I had nine more stanks, I would have had 6,969, which obviously is the most hilarious number. I don't think I can get anything for two tickets. And I can't buy a mango ticket. By the way, papayas, I, I, when I was in Mexico, like about a year ago, dang, that was like about a year ago now, huh? I was like, you know what? I never had papaya before. I'm going to buy some fresh papaya. I thought it was gross and it smelled like feet. So very appropriate for this game called Fragrant Story. Toad said that in Mario Party 1 for the Nintendo 64. That was the one that I played the heck out of with Molly M. It does smell bad. Rogue Effect? Thank you for confirming.
Should I do hard mode on Let Us Fight to find the legendary treasure? Brave the blistering cold in Seeds of Strife. I only have that one challenge, though. Oh, I can do a single random battle, too. Let's try this random battle, this single random battle against Wolfsbane on hard mode. And it starts me with, whoa, with Brad and Ross, and that's it. Okay, so it shows on the right side of the screen that the wolves have a f movement of four. So, one, two, three, four. We can move there. Let's lure him in, boys. What can Ross do? Minty oil. Instantly remove all insects? No, I would rather have bees. What's up, Mayor Nutter? I can confirm papaya smell terrible. Thank you. Gang up on him now. So, what does Brad do? Crisis Guard. Grant. Grant minimum of 1x. Y. That sounds average. Zesty Sesty. It's a melee attack. Let's use it on Ricky Wolf. <gasps> Whoa, okay, so that, okay, I guess it, the spinner being unreliable means that occasionally it can take, like, way longer to stop than normal. Okay, or maybe it is consistently like that. Nope, it's not. Not consistent. Dang, Brad already died. Uh, that spinner was pretty unfortunate. Yeah, this, there's like no way I'm winning this battle. Miss. Nope, he crit. Ching. I got bot. Yeah, let's try again. I don't think this was a bad strategy. Hard mode is still a quarter turn, like half the time or something. Gotta use guarantees like push swing. I would if I had that. I got, I psyched myself out there, I think. Terrible start. Unless I can cause them to miss, like, a bunch. Uh, that seems like it, it did a shortstop, which is a baseball thing. There we go. Phew! Have you ever tried a durian? May or not or no, but I, I have heard those are very fragrant. Say yo. That's the twang sound effect from mm, Smash Bros. Oh, we got rid of one wolf. Ross came to level. That's acceptable. Now I need to roll some misses here. I didn't. And Brad died.
Unreliable spinner. I got crit. Dang, that's like super hard. Don't know if I'm ready for that yet. I watched someone eat durian. I will not go close to it. Yeah, isn't that one of those things that like, they're not allowed in certain countries because of their smell? Good idea, eat it from far away. Such a Brad thing to do, says Jordy Pants. <laughs> All right, let's try it on normal mode now. So when it says timed hits trigger instantly, I assume that means when I hit the A button, it just immediately stops the spinner. I assume that's what that means. Oh good, I got Ash and Chad, who is a Vine Mancer. Vine Whip and Drain Vine. Vine Whip is from Pokemon! This is a melee attack. Oh no, Vine Whip has a range of two! Look at that! Um, well, can Chessie get here? Yeah. Credit. Now all I need to do is hit. Okay, yeah, so next to the spinner it says delay. Wait, maybe I should pay more attention to that. Does it indicate when it's going to um, take a long time to stop? Delay. Durian smell like garbage. I'm glad you said that, Greta Evans, because that reminds me I gotta take out my trash. Okay, my Vine Mancer leveled up. Ability upgrade progress. Defeat an Ice Wolf. This is a Riki Wolf. It's very different from an Ice Wolf. Crit! I'm gonna hop over him and wooden bat him. That's a guaranteed damage right there? That seems pretty good. My last draw of kimchi smelled and tasted like butane. <laughs> this looks a lot like FFT. Yo, Justin Bailey, it does. And it's pretty fun. I need to use her special ability. Oh. It, like, brought him directly next to me. Can I back out of this? No, I can't. Okay, so next to the spinner, it said delayed there, which means it'll do about a quarter turn. Is that what that means? Here it says delayed again. Almost had it. But when it says unreliable, it'll do about a half spin, is what it seems. Push, swing. That baseball sound effect. Ooh, Ash gained a level. Easy money! Wolf's Bane isn't here? Okay, but I get stanks that I can spend at the store, and I found a mango ticket. Hey, Karma. I've never seen this game before. What do you think of it? I'm having a great time with it. Uh, graphics are cute. The dialogue is... Actually, the voice acting's pretty cool. Um, and the... The text otherwise is, like, humorous in a way that I appreciate. Uh, I don't know, some cool stuff about this game. Let's go to the ticket shop. 
Needs more smell puns. I... That makes sense to me, Rogue Effect. Let's get an equipment upgrade. I can increase... I can increase his... Um, I can increase Rhubarb's maximum movement speed. That's what I'm looking for. Scattershot max hits plus one. That seems fine. Prevent movement loss with League Cleats. That doesn't seem amazing. Of course, I'm getting, like, the cheapest... Upgrades possible. Let's get a new challenge. More puns? Like, you mean like smell related puns? No one knows what you mean. I don't know. Hopefully the latter missions don't have you fuming. Rogue effect? I can always count on you. Alright, let's do a challenge. Dude, this is sick. Like, I'm having fun with this game. What are you doing? That's the thing that Kira H and I say to each other all the time. Specifically, we say, what are you doing? I have to send that to her. Did that say moist key? It might have. I totally wasn't even paying attention. But now I have to send this to Kira H. Alright, let's do... What are you doing? On normal difficulty. I keep hitting the A button and the game's like, you can't do that. You gotta hit start. Ooh, and I get to pick who I want to play with. Uh, let's use Jory again. I feel like I didn't properly use my bees. He's got one life, though. Or she, I guess. Actually can't tell. Sure, let's use Queenie. What happens if I do this? I just, I get one crit. I liked Bree. I think snack time is really good. Plus she's got Vile Vox. she got a ranged attack. And let's, let's use Ash. Time to get some sleep. Yo, Justin McDonald? Thanks so much for showing up. Is this a physical game? It is, Bit Goblin. I, I have a physical copy anyway. But, um... I have to imagine you can download this on the 3DS shop. I am 99% certain. Get stung by a bramble bee? That would kill me. The shop dead. I've like never ever owned a 3DS. E-shop dead. Oh, Tita Russell. Yeah, okay. So yeah, um, I I posted a link to William Cage's website where you can like pre-order a physical copy. But summon a bee. Do does Jory get experience if you if the bee kills something? Oh, that's neat that she can refill some of her resources there. Get him, B. Looks like Final Fantasy Tactics with more earthboundy graphics. Yeah, exactly. Jory spawns don't do XP. So I actually have to do a melee attack with Jory in order to get a level up for her. Aha! Let's attack the sewer trap. 
Dang it, I missed the crit. That's okay. I think this vile vile will do it. And I got a delayed hit. Oh, so this will always steal a damage. Okay, so it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what I do here. 3DS was an amazing handheld. I own four myself. I have never had one until recently. Thanks to my friend, William Cage. Oh, I can fight this guy. Oh, let's go for the crit. I didn't quite get it. It only has two moves. Summon a bee! It's like this center tile right here is like really pivotal to this mission, huh? I'm gonna get closer to this guy, I guess. No, stop killing my bee! My bee. Wooden bat this character. Credit him. See ya. Ash gained a level. That's nice. Um, Queenie can level up right now. With a regular hit! You should try the AR function. It's pretty crazy. If you don't have the cards, you can print them and they work all the same. Interesting. Alright, Jory, let's get you in there. Yes! I can move on to the center island. Does that sewer trap... Move? Can't quite hit from there. Oh cool, I have this game, says David G. Yeah, what do you think of it? I'm having a fun time. I'm gonna crit this guy again. Whew, just made it. Boom! Zesty, zesty. I couldn't quite figure it out. There's no story as far as I can tell, right? Well, the story is like explained on the website that this this is an arcade game that the characters from his other game are playing. Kira H, I was just talking about you. Uh, this mission is called What Are You Doing? And I know you appreciate that. Do you shoot long ropes? Tim C, I shoot whatever I want to shoot. <laughs> hey, Rogue Effect, and everyone else that I'm less familiar with. I got a mango ticket. Well, let's go spend some ticks. I have four. I could buy another. They're cheaper if you buy in bulk. How did I not notice that earlier? Because I was too busy looking at all my beautiful viewers. Oh, 
Okay, maybe I'll save up and get 20% off. Yo, you were cleaning the bathroom, Carlos Phillips? That's something I gotta do. I'm glad you remound me. Stole my key. Yank key? I get it, because that's a baseball team. And one of the characters does baseball stuff. I can get a library bee key? That seems like a decent upgrade. Accuracy plus one. Well, why don't we do like the next part of the story mode before we spend any more muns. I love cleaning the bathroom for some reason. Carlos Phillips, like any, every time I'm done with it, I'm like, I have this, I have a, a sense of accomplishment right now. That's how I feel anyway. All right, let's do normal difficulty because I'm not a pro at this game yet. And I will press the start button to begin. Listen up. You've graduated from Buds to Florence. The team I see before me is strong, but let's just say needs a little more watering. Ha! It's a flower's for joke. You, opportunity looms large. Our scouts have identified several areas suffering from extreme overgrowth. We need to make our way to these areas and trim things down a bit. This is where you prove your parlor. Training time is over. Look sharp. I will. I always look sharp, according to Sean Robinson. All right, so this is like Papaya's special mission, and she is required. But that's great, because I love Papaya. Have I, is there anyone I haven't used yet? Rose Sword is like a decent ability. I mean, Drain Vine, I mean. Queenie seemed fine. I want to put Bree in. This sound effect right here, I think that's from Soul Blazer on the SNES. That sound effect sounds familiar too, the, when you like enter a character into the battle. All right, let's summon more bees and then put Ash in. And you know what? Let's use a coin to get somebody to level two to start. Why not? I hate papaya. It tastes like socks. Cure H. I was just saying that that it's it, like it smells like feet. But papaya candy is awesome. The mountains are not far from here. This mission will be chilly. Already the air is cooler. How does she know the mountains are not Let's far from here? Make way, fiends. Fiends is one letter away from fiend. Through. What's with these crates? Try giving them a whack. I will. They like immediately explode. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, that was an earthbound sound effect. That pushed kind of sound. Hello, says Elliot S. Yo, welcome back. Jump? I love that they just flip. Um, how much HP do these little bugs have? Just one? Yes, I can get Jory a level up.
I'm actually not going to summon a bee just yet. I was setting up to play more BG3. You've distracted me. Kira H, you've been playing Baldur's Gate? Or does BG stand for something else? That thing can only move two? All right, let's, let's break the boxes. I'm gonna hit the far box, as a matter of fact. Try hitting the bugs with a crate. Yeah, that's what I thought I was doing there, but um, apparently, like, I, for some reason, I thought the push swing would push it infinitely, but it did not. I'm gonna stand here. I'm gonna have Jory stand here. Yes! That's exactly where I wanted him to stand. Wait, is this rock gonna block me if I try to push swing this way? Let's try it. Okay, yeah, it did hit the rock. Dang it! <laughs> hit him with the B wand. Crunch! I defeated a Bramble B. I'm gonna hit the crate with a vile vile. Yes, I finally started Baldur's Gate, says Kira H, and my character Brinja is majorly hot. That's the most important quality of a ninja, or a char any character. I assume she's a ninja because it rhymes with Brinja. By the way, thanks William Cage for dominating Xmas, yeah. Dude just sent me a big old box of gifts and that was really cool. One of the gifts was Pocky. Oh, so close. So close to getting the miss. Alright, I'll have Ash um, just get a level up here. Oh wait, that didn't kill him. I'm an idiot. I forgot the mouse had more than one HP. Well, this is bad, because now I could possibly be in trouble. No, I will use Scattershot. It's pronounced green, yeah. <laughs> Tim C, you behave. Recover a crit with snack time. I want to recover a heart with it. That's what I want to do. Nice. I healed Ash. I've never played a Baldur's Gate game. But from what I understand, they are Baldur's great. God, I'm so clever. Alright, bring the bug. Oh, there's two rats, too. Those things are really hard to see when you're colorblind and also regular blind. Let's hit him with a vile vile. They've only got two HP to begin with. Okay. Yeah, the automatic damage seems pretty nice. And, like, when I finally hit an enemy with another enemy, that's going to be cool, too. Nick Track, what's going on? Very much worth playing, says Kira H. I'm very bad at sitting down to dedicate time for video games, but have played D&D for over a decade. And this game has got me coming back to it daily. That sounds awesome. Should I stream it? A 
I pushed him back into my ally, which didn't hurt her, and that's cool. Yes! Level up! Yes, stream with me. I for sure would do that. Alright, Bree, let's get you to level 2. The spinner is the best part of the game. Bree gained a level and can now crit. Oh no, more enemies! One of those rats is not like the other. Has three HP. That's insane. Uh, what is their move like? They can each move three. So, so this guy can move here. I'm gonna move one and summon a B. And put it like a little bit out of the way. I guess I'll restore a crit with snack time. Or I'll try. Easy money. I just got a D&D starter kit. My kids request it, says Bitgoblin. Dragons of Stormwreck Isle. Uh, I have the other one from... Um, fifth edition. I was about to say season five. I have... Uh, the Lost Mines of Fandelvar or something, I think is what it's called. Ooh, I got the miss. This bug is gonna get missed again. Easy money! That bug is so evasive. Gosh dang it, if I could get here, I could push a rat into a rat. Alright, here's what I'm gonna do. Let's crit this guy. And get more experience for Jory. My B Mage. Which is usually short for Black Mage. In other games. But now I need to, like, protect him at all costs. She can crit with Vile Vile now. Oh, that was bad. Ooh. Ah, uh, but it only hits two targets. I, I don't think it, um... I don't think it can deal multiple damage to one target. Alright, I might need to have a lucky dodge here with Jory. Get him, B. Nope, he's gonna attack the B. That's great. Dang it, my B died. Hit him with the B wand. I love this one HP character. Don't dodge it, try to block it. Exactly. New battle added to quick start menu. I wonder what it is. I bet it was that battle. Chapter 5. Patchwork Pond. We have arrived at our base camp. The water freezes, even here. Are you getting cold? Yeah, I don't... I warned you, didn't I? I don't think water is exempt from the rules of chemistry or physics depending on your location.
Oh my gosh, there are pumpkins. And a bee! Two can play at this game. I will summon bee. This song is awesome. Ooh, that's spooky. Gosh, and I love that they just flip. They just flip out. Three can play at this game. Seed spit. Ooh, we can shoot pretty far, huh? Kabo Kaze is the name of that enemy. He missed the B. Pumpkin's just a little guy. I still have the silly little flips. Yeah, I'm obsessed with the pumpkin. Jordy Pants? I agree with you. Alright, when can I have more than one B? Maybe when I level up the ability, but I can't. Seems like a good idea. A -ba -ba -ba. I bet Kabokaze means self destruct. I think it means pumpkin. Um, let's move like here. This guy. Oh, dang it, I can't back out of this. I think I wanted to heal my dude. Got lucky, though. Crit the Kabokaze. Um, actually, it's pretty unfortunate that that B is in the way now. Get him, B. Yeah, that's right. Summon. Kaze means wind, yeah. Yeah, the word kamikaze means divine wind. Actually, um, first I want to move, like... You know what? She's probably fine where she is, considering I might have uh, enemies spawning in after this. Let's recover a heart. I always loved your sense of humor, Karma Jolt. Yo, Carlos Phillips, thank you so much. I appreciate that. I'm gonna stand behind my B. And move like here. I don't want Jory to get too close, cause like, he's got, she's got one HP maximum. the miss. Alright, I have to get close to this guy, but I can't hit him from here. I guess I'll do snack time again. It's free to do? That's crazy. I recovered a thing. Oh, this guy's only got one HP. All right, let's see it's slinging then. Oh no, more enemies. Um, I don't love how close they are to my friend named Debris. I'm gonna have her retreat, actually. And recover a crit on Papaya. All 
Alright, I'm gonna let them come to me. It was meant to be a... Demon... Wait. Kamaze had a brother of Thunder and Lightning, I think. I say demon, but they don't really have angels and devils like the Jin. Interesting. Jin interesting. Sorry, that was just too clever of a joke. Shouldn't have made that. Shouldn't have said that. It's in a movement range of three. I don't know what his attack range is, but it's probably like two or three. Yeah, this music is great. Tumble Joe. Uh, this map kind of sucks for my melee characters. All right, let's gang up on this guy with a vile vile. Great. Good, I needed that. Regular hit! And a level up, I think. Yeah, one more HP, that's awesome. Get him, B. That's right, absorb those hits. Dang it, I finally got hit. My B! Could have got the kill that turn, but I punted it. Summon B. Ooh, look at that. 100% hit rate for that B. <laughs> I like the guncock sound effect for the seed spit. He missed. Get dodged. I'll take that block. That's fine. Man, Ash is like totally useless this battle. I can jump right in here, I guess, and vile, vile this dusky rat. Love it. Regain a level. That's dope. I know this is risky. But let's block this guy. Oh, wait. I don't know. Actually, can I block him? Yeah, if he attacks Jory, that could be a problem. Oh, he's attacking my B. Get Jory another level up. Ah. Yes, finally has two HP. Did you ever watch The Wicker Man? Is that with Is that with Nicolas Cage, who I think is unrelated to William Cage? It's 
Summon B. Let's use um, Seed Sling here and try to get a crit. Whew, just got it. Alright, now Ash can like finally get some experience. Push Swing automatically deals 1 HP. Oh, get him, Helper B. Man, he really wants to attack my B. But he missed! This is fun. Should I get Jewelry to max level? Should I just like buff him all the way up? I guess it's, I guess she's a lady. B wand. Yeah, but they have that beehive hat thingy on his head. Oh yeah, I remember that. something. Recovered one block. Ooh, jump right in. Frostbite. Wait, wasn't somebody supposed to defeat an ice wolf? Good thing I recovered that block. A regular hit and then let Ash get the final hit. Push swing. Bah. Uh is this the third wave of enemies? Says Jamal. Oh yeah, I think it was. Look at that. Patchwork pawn success. New battle added. Chapter 6 Dander Ridge. Yes, this is it. Quite overgrown up here, that's for sure. Looks like the fog is clearing. Hey, who goes there? Show yourself. Uh, just a dog. Kabocha at your service. I can tell you're getting nervous. If I may try to persuade, there's no need to be afraid. Our patch is late to bloom, you see, but you can dine with us for eternity. Gapama for some, Bundavera for others. There's plenty for all, no matter your druthers. Seems I've lost my appetite. Wanna hear something crazy? By order of the voice of that pumpkin must be is paid. Chris Sarandon, who did the voice of Jack Skellington. Oh, really? <laughs> yeah, Gemalad. Silly floristas. You've had your little warm-up with Wolfsbane. But those dog days are done. 
And now, the harvest has come. Look at you. All sugar, no substance. A pitiful pawpaw, green and brash. You best run back to Mommy Mango. Sounds like a skeleton to me, says Rug Effect. In any case, your season is over. We're here year round. Yeah, we're here. <laughs> is that a challenge? Well, that's just vine by me. Oh my god. Now then, to the pain. That pumpkin needs an eye patch. But yeah, that's actually Chris Sarandon, who was the voice of Jack Skellington in The Nightmare Before Christmas. And also in Kingdom Hearts! Oh. I'm guessing he's got, like, crazy range. Ooh, let's hit him with a big snowball! I'm gonna have him move one back and summon B. Like here. I'm guessing that that big old pumpkin in the middle of the stage can like shoot me from anywhere. And he was in Princess Bride. Uh, why are you attacking the snow mound? It's a snow puff, I believe. Pumpkins are the future. Oh no, more pumpkins. Or possibly he just summons one every round. Frostbite. Nice. Miss. Should I just like run up and smack this guy, you think? Yeah, I'm gonna have Ash run up and be a hero. And I will attack Ice Wolf. Ugh, I tried to get the crit. Can I crit with this, you think? I'm just gonna do a uh, guaranteed damage here. And scatter shot! Ha, ha. Get him, B. Helper B is such a good helper. Oh no, more pumpkins. Damn, yeah, he just keeps summoning them. Nice. I'm getting good at this game, everybody. Forced to bite. Yo, Carlos Phillips, thank you so much for the cool $2. Karma Jolts, the greatest live streamer. Hey, appreciate you. Ruxo Clown? That's right, pumpkins in the chat, everybody. That bee is so dodgy. Play your turn. Alright, get him, Ash. You know what? Before I do that... I'm gonna hit him with the bee wand. King Kabocha. Yeah. That's it. I don't even have to beat the rest of the pumpkins. Efficiency bonus, $1,200. I mean, stanks. Excuse me. Nice work. Thanks. Collect your collards and rest up. Ha. 
You unlocked a new character. A dude with a headband. New items added to ticket shop. I found a mango ticket. This is amazing. Oh, and I can even speed up the things that are already pretty fast there. Uh, what's in the ticket shop? What's in it? What's in it for me? A frog coin. Uh, that looks like it's new, right? Man, so many unlockables here. I can get three mango tickets at a discount. Or I could recolor main menu background. <sighs> Alright, what do I want? Should I just buff up one character with like everything that's available? Where's my B mage? That's her right there. I can only get shields for my B mage. Uh, and this is the new guy I just unlocked, huh? So can you smell the story? Is it truly fragrant? I can, Ruxo Clown. Is that supposed to be like earthbound colors? Yes, Jamalad. Yeah, all of those colors that you can get um, are the same colors that you can make the like the text box borders in earthbound. With the exception of berry is probably supposed to be strawberry flavor. They call them flavors in earthbound. All right, well, obviously, let's do this. I have eight mango tickets. I don't use this wrestler guy. But max HP plus one on anyone seems amazing. Banana cup. Amazing. Uh, you know what? Let's buff Chessy. And then use her in the next, um, story mode, I guess. I'll tell you what, though. My legs are starting to hurt from sitting so much, so, like, I think I'm gonna call the stream here. Thank you so much, everybody, for watching me play Fragrant Story on the Nintendo DS. Check out the links in the video description. Go to williamcage.com. At the very least, like, take a look at his stuff and listen to his music, because the man is talented. Um, but, like, if you're interested in this game, go ahead and pre-order it off of his website. Or, like, at least just browse his website and learn more about it. If you want to know what the physical copy box looks like, it's this. Hold on. On some lights and do those. Yeah, he sent me a physical copy of Fragrant Story on the Nintendo 3DS. Uh, not to mention, actually, actually, I don't know if I'll be able to find it, but let me, let me be right back.
So... William Cage sent me a couple things that go with the uh, collector's edition. I just sat on my headphones here. Uh, and there are like some some heart pins here, as well as a pin of rhubarb, which is super cool. But he also sent me a Kingdom of Flower Guard one standard rank, aka a stank. With a little note that says, thank you very much. So I thought I'd show that off before I signed off. But like, it's a cool game and then there's cool stuff if you want the collector's edition. Anyway, I'm signing off. Thank you so much for watching me play this game. It means a lot to me. Uh, hope to see you next time. But until then, this is Karma Jolt signing off. Tell your friends I'm great. And go check out WilliamCage.com. Oh, that is rank, it says Rogue Effect. I just got that. I didn't get it earlier. Alright, see ya.